Josh Paul's here with uh, Nico Landeros, two-time Paralympic gold medalist. Nico, what was it like here at Sochi? You know, it's uh, super beautiful. It's like I'm at a resort in the Bahamas, except a little colder. But uh, it's pretty sweet, great venue, here with uh, great people, and we had a great time. So uh, who would you like to thank back home? Uh, I'd like to thank, you know, my parents, uh, all of Colorado, USA Hockey, USOC, and uh, the United States as a whole for uh, everyone tuning in and watching us play. Thank you. Josh Paul's here with Dan McCoy, a member of the gold medal winning U.S. Paralympic sled hockey team. Dan, what was it like here in Sochi in your first Paralympics? It was an incredible feeling, you know, uh, just being able to represent the country with uh, the best team in the world. You know, it's, it was a great feeling. It's a dream come true for me. And uh, we saw you had a couple crazy buddies. Uh, can you tell us more about them? The one guy had a morph suit, I think. Yeah, um, they've been my best friends since uh, elementary school. So um, to have them here, uh, it was awesome, along with my family. Um, they're, they're the biggest fans I've had here so um, yeah it was a great feeling to have them here and uh, supporting me through this whole thing. They sure were pretty awesome in the crowd. Is there anybody else you'd like to thank back home? Uh, just everyone in Pittsburgh, um, the Penguins, everyone. Just all my friends and family uh, from my high school, uh, Pitt, everyone. So That gold medal looks beautiful around your neck. Thank you. <laughs> Josh Paul's here with uh, two-time captain and two-time gold, Paralympic gold medalist Andy Yowie. Uh Andy, what was it like here in Sochi in your third games? Oh, man, I think they did a great job with the games. The venues were cool. The village was nice. Uh, the competition was great. Uh, obviously, we came with gold, so it just couldn't have been better, Josh. Awesome. Sounds great. So uh, you had some family here, am I right? I did. I had my dad and my brother came to support me. Uh, I really appreciate those guys coming out, and uh, it was awesome to have all of our fans in the crowd, everyone's friends and family, uh, you know, anybody we could get here. Uh, it was just awesome. For sure. It's always great to have people to support us. Anybody else you'd like to thank back home? Uh, I'd like to thank my wife and my kids uh, for letting me leave, um, and then uh, everybody else in the Quad Cities that uh, supported me. Awesome. Josh Paul's here with uh, our two teenagers, and together we formed the Diaper Line, and or no, also known as the Green Line. So, uh, Declan, what was it like here in your first Paralympics at only 16? Oh, it was a great experience. It was really fun to be a part of, and it's just an honor to be here. Awesome. Brody, this is uh, Brody Roybal. Brody, how does it feel to have that gold medal around your neck? It's, it feels amazing to be such a young age and win a gold medal. So, Declan, uh, I want to ask you, is there anybody back home that you'd like to thank? Uh, just thanks to everyone back in Tampa that watched on uh, NBC Sports. It means a lot, all your support. Uh, it's awesome. Brody, same question. Anybody you'd like to thank back home? I'd also like to thank everyone back home who supported me my whole way getting here. Thank you, guys.